Hey guys, welcome to what I'm going to start, because Mighty Number Name came out, uh, like, yesterday. So, this is a game I've been waiting for for three years. Uh, full disclosure, I backed the game. Um, I, I have a feeling the game doesn't deserve all the hate it's getting. I think it's like a mixture of delays and just stuff like the Red Ash Kickstarter and everything like that. Um, it's definitely something that, like, was, uh, that didn't help a lot. So, I'm starting to do a thing where I'm going to start taking notes on my episodes, so I know roughly where about, about stuff I want to talk about. I made the mistake doing the Final, Final Fantasy X playthrough where I brought up stuff I want to talk about but didn't have a point to reference to immediately. So I have a notepad beside me, a notebook and everything, and some pens so I'm going to write down timestamps and then like a couple of words from time to time just to kind of keep track of what I was doing. If I had a second person doing these with me, then that would be fucking... they could do that. Um, but I'm going to be the one doing that, so that's fine. Um, but yeah. I'm using Fraps today to record stuff, so it will probably, uh, yeah. I, my, my PC should be able to run this game fine on high graphics. Might turn off the motion blur, we'll see how obnoxious that is. There's a lives remaining. Confirm cancel button, normal reverse, that's cool. Ooh, what's that? That is so fucking cool. I forgot they were putting in... I forgot they were putting in, uh, like, 8-bit retro themes. Oh, that is so awesome! Do I have to say... yeah, that's fine. Alright. So, I did some audio testing. I should be coming out over top of this, over the audio, but, like, I didn't start the game. I was just running off of the main front menu, so I'll have to stop and listen to myself for a little bit. Even that's extra difficulty. No questions asked. One hit death mode. From my understanding and what I've heard so far, this game's actually fairly difficult. It's really pretty art style. It is the present. Year. Very colorful. Breakthroughs in robotic technology have ushered in a new era of peace and prosperity. Violence is confined to the Battle Coliseum, where robot combatants face off in spectacular duels. The narrator reminds me Today, of the, the guy from walls once Mega Man again Legends echo who narrated the shouts and cheers of excited fans. When An exciting, suddenly, the exciting life of diggers. In a world flooded where few patches of land where humans survive. Mega Man Legends. So to my understanding is that the Mighties were like the most popular and there were nine of them in the battle arenas. And nine was the only one that wasn't effective. So you play Mighty number nine. Or Beck. System ready? Go! Professor! Ah, Beck. And functioning normally, it would appear. What on earth has happened? It's chaos everywhere. Well, well, Dr. we won't White. figure it out here. We must make for the laboratory. If the enemy, and if the enemy doctor's name, Beck, like Dr. Lily or something like that, I would die. I'll follow and monitor your progress. Yes, sir. He doesn't seem to do anything, what doesn't do anything, triggers don't do anything, or no don't do anything. The game's very pretty. Is there like a wall slide? No, it just seems to be a light grab. Okay. I guess we'll have to see how the game behaves without the, uh, 
with those as wall grabs. It's not Mega Man. It seems like a weird amalgamation. Once again, the president has declared a countrywide state, state of emergency. emergency. This based on reports of haywire robots rampaging out of control in all 52 states. I'm being told we have a Look comment from Gregory Graham, CEO of Cherry Dynamics. Cherry We're going to form a new initiative, Overwatch, to deal with these problems. Mighty number nine, the backstory of Overwatch. Attention, <laughs> attention, is this thing on? <clears throat> My fellow Americans. He looks like a scumbag. So we he's totally going to be the villain. I'd just like to express that this isn't our fault. Oh it's my that god. Dr. Blackwell, he's the one behind this. Blame him! My god. <laughs> we at Cherry Dine are doing all we can to help nope. fix the situation. Why Cherry Dine was a shot at Apple? Hello, is this thing on? Avi? <clears throat> and now let's go live to our Eye in the Sky Avi for today's Avi News Traffic Report. Thanks, Avi. As you can see, we've got a few accidents we found on, well, everywhere! Mighty number six! W what does he think he's doing? Their style is, like, super pretty. A little bot. A security bot. And it's out of control, unlike all the others. Back. There's no other way. You'll need to fight your way through. You can handle this. I know you can. Professor, I... I'll do it. Beck, did you just absorb the cells of a weakened robot and... My goodness, assimilate them? Uh, of course, I designed him with that capability. But I hadn't thought it functional yet. Why now? Okay. So the dash makes up for a lot of the high maneuverability stuff, because like the dash is like the primary go-to thing. I needed that. Bomber. Did I break that? Oh, it's probably actually. Oh, throw something at me. That's more like it. It's the little dude I keep picking up. It's the. St Oh, I see. Cute. That's more Okay. Found the side that looks like a secret. Whatever that is, don't know. Wait, did I use a wall grab there? No, I seem to maneuver pretty so pretty solidly. Seems to handle pretty well. Oh, did I get that? Is that a thing? Did I get that? That looks important. Maybe something like second playthrough. So I just have to like digitize enemies. Whoa! That's one level. 
So once they're like affected by like digital sense like that, I can just absorb them. Okay, so they won't all like. So they won't all just automatically. Okay, and your shots have like a little bit of an AoE. Okay, so I shot that projectile out of Okay. So that's how access to the like. Here we go. Here we go. That's more like it. Uh down A to fall through floors. Okay. Here we go. What? Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, it looks like I'm writing that down. People can play for this game was. Lab is just ahead. Sonda. Sonda, are you still there? Have the robots torn you to pieces? Criminy! What was that? No, oh, probably gotta let that play out. A demolition unit! How on earth did it manage to get down there? Back, quickly! You must stop it before it destroys the entire laboratory! Wonder how many. Bigger. System to this game. Sonda, are you all right? Well, back. Thank goodness. Uh, but where are the other mighty numbers? Well, based on empirical evidence, I believe they might be suffering from this robot affliction that's going around. Crikey! It's like every bot in America went completely nuts all at once. Let me contact yes, my brother America. at the office in Tokyo. Maybe he can send help. I'm sorry, Soichiro. Please understand. The Japanese government won't let us intervene until we know the cause of the malfunctions. Which is fair. Hmm. I was afraid of that. But it makes sense. After all, any robots you send to help could be affected as well, making things even worse. Yeah, I'm done. That's Just it. to confirm, Mr. Sonda. I love the colors. You can in isolate this game. the cause of the robot rampage. You'll send aid. Like Absolutely. the character with the least amount of White. color palette Anything is probably the main character do. Beck himself. Did you have a plan in mind? Which is yes. actually kind of funny we'll when you look Beck at it that way. Track down all his fellow mighty numbers. Great idea. Wait, what? His assimilation ability should filter any irregularities from his siblings' programming. If we can gather and study multiple samples, perhaps we can isolate the cause of the problem. Like all the other characters, it's use a really colorful shot, color palette, which is actually kind of funny. Hope. The main the character is like looks like the most drowned out in color, which I'll is kind of funny. I'll finish reactivating calls so she can provide support. 
Let's those dead, it. unloving eyes of of call. Professor, I uh. This is a very Mega Man esque that. beginning. Well within your except, capabilities. you know, Mega Man wasn't a fighting robot, and he was just a housemaid, and then he was just like, no, I'll step up to do it. New content in extra mode is here. Challenge solo. New content in extra mode is here. All right, on quit stuff. your lollygagging. It's up to us to stop those rampaging bots. Number two, three, number one. Ah, a new training mode is ready. Attention. Okay. Game Configure. options. Ooh. Don't know what that does. Hopefully, I'll explain that. No options, though, just the option screen. Okay. Back to title. All right. Quit your lollygagging. It's. Next mode. View assorted online leaderboard. Yeah, it's Ooh, not. The VR training program I devised. Uh, care to try it? Yeah, I'll try and I'll try one of these challenge modes really quick. Back. Reach the goal, Vex health runs out, time expires. Social measures accelerate can't be used, attack can't be used. Alright. So it just hopefully it just restricts me from it. Right. Go! Alright. Oh shit, those guys have like a really long cooldown on their stuff. No, the challenges seem pretty good. I like the matrix test looking, uh... Ooh, that was close. Oh, it's gonna be further. Okay. Okay. Mission! Clear! Okay. That's not so bad. Let's show those other obstacle course guy really quick here. Ready? Go! Actually, hold on. Get that down really quick. There we go. Okay. See, this obstacle is actually pretty cool. Oh, that's cool. There's that little bot on the bottom this time, because I gotta see what that is. Because I think the last time I collected it, it was a speed boost? So they do expect, like, a lot of, kind of, like, perfectionism out of you, too, which is nice for the challenge modes. Here we go! Okay, so yeah, it's a speed boost. Okay. Definitely useful for this. Okay, so I can't quite clear the gaps. Just trying to learn, like, the... Trying to learn, like, the jump arcs and stuff like that. This game is definitely, like, does not deserve the hate that it's been getting so far, though. Like, like, I don't understand people's issues with it. Oh, fuck. Nope, not gonna make it again. Okay, so 
so going for the speed up is probably a trap then. Because just going straight through it the first time worked fine. System ready? Go! Okay. Come on. There we go. Come on. There we go. Come on. Come on. Up. Because the speed up is nice, but it's not necessary. These other rank things will be an interesting one, but I'm just to see how they implement these further into the game. And the game's intuitive grab system is actually really nice, because like, you just auto-grab stuff as long as you push up alongside, there's no like secondary button to hit. So it's actually pretty cool, I enjoy that. Oh, costume change? <laughs> I should show that off. I wonder what this looks like. Hold on, I'm just gonna go into this thing to see what this looks like. System ready? Go! Yeah, look at that. Yeah, it's actually it's something you got as a back reward if you paid a lot of money in. So it's actually it's actually pretty cool. It looks nice. It's even got like an emissive glow to it, just to make it all like mystical and bullshit. That's actually nice, I like that. Anyways. Tire. Yes, good challenge. Alright. So I'd say this is probably a pretty good spot to stop for the first episode. So, we'll call that good. The challenges are cool, I like that. The Ooh, color palette in those games is beautiful, it's aesthetically right. very pleasing. The voices all sound pretty good. To stop those rampaging bots. Like, it looks like he's not great, but like, it's not like Mega Man 8, like, Dr. Wally thing that are going on with it, so like, it was, you know, solid. I, I like it. Although I expect him to make Call look a little more... As the game progresses. Like, she's the way the community sure voted on her, but uh, her eyes are like, dead. Choose your next target. It'd be nice going between these screens if they didn't, like, say something every time. Like, uh, like that, that's a bit of a nitpick. But several of the game seems to handle fine. It sounds like an odd mixture between the original Mega Man and Mega Man X. So, I mean, whatever. And then with a little bit of flavor thrown in. So, thank you guys for watching. It was episode 1 of Made Number 9. Please like, please like, please comment, please subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next episode.